I reached out to you what, three years ago, four years ago now, almost four, four years, years in April. Yeah. Four years in April to ask you if you'd ever heard of EXP. My wife and I, we made the move over. We, we'd been at an independent company for seven years. Just when we left Keller Williams, went basically to a hundred percent company. Again, just tired of paying all the fees, you know, just didn't need to because um, I had all my own stuff. Saw EXP. I moved to EXP February, 2018 and reached out to you soon after that. You know, um, what, how has EXP solve some of those challenges that you had being your own broker because now um, you're not your own broker anymore you know there's there's i'm still a broker an ego thing there you know that can be there. oh yeah I'm losing my brand or losing they think that you know but talk about that transition for you. yeah i mean there's a little bit of a mental hurdle to jump over you know like oh i'm not the guy anymore i'm not the broker but i'm still a broker so i mean i still when i'm i'm a broker once a broker, always a broker, as long as you keep your license active, right? So yeah. I'd say that's the first like mental challenge I had to get over. But the second thing was I was able to now start taking those items off my plate or off the balance sheet, the negative side of things. You know, I didn't have to have this 2000 square foot office that nobody came to. You know, um, I didn't have to pay e &O insurance anymore. You know, our e &O insurance was gonna go up to like 16,000 a year. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so it's insanity for 12 or 10 people at that time. So I didn't have those expenses. And, you know, so I, I really just started putting pen to paper. And before you had come to me, I'd always talk to my wife and you know, said, somebody's gotta figure this out to where you can create a residual income uh, or a retirement within the real estate world. I tried to do it with my agents like, Hey, I'll give you two and a half percent of every commission of anybody that you refer to the company that comes and joins of when they sell, you'll get two and a half percent of it out of my side, not yours. Right. So I tried to do something like that, but it never worked. There was never, you know, very few ever did anything with that. When you came with the XP, showed me what it was. We actually sat down and studied it. Like I didn't just oh, watch it while I was watching something else or, you know, whatever ball game was on and I watched, I actually studied it. Cause I was at that point where I was like, I need to see what this really means. You know, and if you did it, I know you and you know, I respect you as a business person. I was like, okay, so Jeff's in there, you know, let me check this out. Mm -hmm. So we really put pen to paper, went through everything and it just made the most financial sense from being able to eliminate stuff off the balance sheet, but also give us a lot more leverage on the backside with the brokerage.